Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score the contest, 30-26, 30-26, and 30-24 for the winner by unanimous decision and still undefeated, the future, Ian Machado! Sir, I'm here with the winner, Ian Machado Gary, ladies and gentlemen, and what a show. You completely dominated what many people thought was going to be your biggest test so far in the octagon. Yeah, I told everybody the exact opposite. I told everybody, when I show up, I surgically dominate, and that was my plan today. That guy has fought some of the best in the welterweight division. That was his 31st fight, and I made it look like he's never fought in the octagon before. Was there ever a moment where you were surprised that you weren't able to get him out because you hit him with everything but the kitchen sink? No, I took my time, I showed patience, I showed what a, an elite level striker in this division is. How many times have we seen people get knocked out when they try to rush for a finish? That was domination from start to finish. I heard him, I heard him, and I kept talking to him. I meant, I meant that, that today was justice. Now this was an important fight for you a big test, and this sets you up for bigger tests. Oh, yeah. Give us your thoughts on what you would like to face next. So first he bust in. Let me hear you, I absolutely love you. You hear this? Hey, I love you. Look, this breaks me into the UFC top 10. I'm 25 years of age, and I'm telling you now, I need to prove myself as the best striker that this division had ever seen. And Joe, I think you can guess where I'm going here. To be the best striker in the world, you need to beat the best strikers. And everybody has Stephen Wonderboy Thompson on that list. So give me Stephen Wonderboy Thompson whenever, wherever, for five rounds, and I will prove to you I am the new generation of striker in the world. Well, I can't wait to see that, sir. Congratulations on a sensational performance. Ian Machado Gary!